Hello everyone, welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to be covering how to add step by step your own fonts inside ClickFunnels and then upload them to your specific funnel. So let's jump right in. The first thing that you need to have is just a font. Uh, um, it's just your fonts saved in a folder. After that, what you need to do is uh, go ahead and go to settings um, account settings and then digital assets once you get to the digital assets what you want to do is go over here and add new assets now here is where you uh, tell click funnels what uh, you want to add so you go ahead and choose the file here give it a proper name and for example um, you need to distinguish the two fonts so what you should do is just copy the name of the font and paste it here and then uh, from this doesn't um, this, you don't need to fill any of this information and after that what you want to do is add right so you add the font you give it a name and you add it once that happens you are going to have it uh, installed here so I have uh, just a few of them installed uh, and I have them here okay go ahead do that for two three four fonts that you want to use I recommend to use at least two types of fonts in one funnel one bold and one regular but you can use more than one and then two fonts um, after that what you want to do is go to um, your funnel and uh, you need to tell click funnels what you want to do okay so you go to custom CSS and uh, you need to paste this code there I'm gonna have this code uh, available to you if you want um, and what this basically does is it imports a font uh, and you are going to give the instructions where to import the font and now this is where the click funnels is going to apply the font so it's going to apply everything that is headline and everything that is the button you can change this according to what your needs and the font uh, family will be a uh, name here okay after that we have the same code but now we want for font weight normal because this one's bold right this bold is go going to be normal or regular and we are going to apply that to all the other things okay awesome now how can we uh, tell and mention click funnels um, where to get those fonts so we go here and we select the, the font that we want to add so for example this is a uh, the regular one so what we need to do is go here and copy asset path once we do have that let's go to the source URL and then paste it here let me tell you that I pay I copied the regular one so let me not uh, miss, um, get this wrong this is going to for the poll so let's paste it in the regular now we have uh, the name of the font and regular ready to be uh, uploaded now what we want to do is give it uh, the proper name so the proper name can be uh, this one that you just mentioned here so let's copy this one uh, and paste it here okay awesome now the next path you need to do is font family and gi let's give it the same name that you have here boom after that what we want to do is go for the bold one okay so same process go for the bold copy asset and come here and then paste it in the source URL there you go you have the bold now you just copy the name because this, this name is the exact same name I have here okay you copy the name and paste it here and paste it here after you do these changes what you're gonna have is uh, um, everything detailed to the font that you want to use so this is after and this is going to be before so before and after all right you can do this to any font you'd like just give the proper steps and you're gonna have it cheers